Hello everyone, this is my work in Cinema 4D. Uh, this is a character that I have modeled, um, textured and rigged and now I'm animating it. I have published some of uh, facial rigging and uh, stuff like that from this model, but back then it wasn't rigged. Um, as you might know this is Sasuke Uchiha from uh, Naruto, the anime and manga. Um, what I've done here is just very basic bone structure with easy tools. Um, then I have done both more for facial, facial expressions, for example eyes and uh, angry face, so it's easy to animate. Uh, what I'm doing here on, on this video is this is scene 2. Uh, I al already have rendered scene 1 and some of the later scenes. Uh, the few second Susano uh, awakening clip that's one that will be on uh, the complete animation. I have uploaded that Susano one. You can check out that on my channel. Um, it's just about 10 seconds or something like that and uh, but here I have made uh, as you can see there are main frames that show where the character will be at those points for example 10, 15, 30, 55 and uh, like that and then I'm just creating sub uh, uh, correcting the subframes like this one that the leg is skipping through the floor to the main frame and uh, like that I it's not harder than that when it's com uh, when it's correctly rigged um, I'm going to upload some of these videos uh, I'm not going to record all because this will be a, a huge job um, there is complete cloth dynamic for the shirt and dress to go to with this of course there will probably be problems with uh, for example in this scene too this will be in slow motion and there will be a lot of uh, movement fast movement as uh, he dodges a kunai here and uh, another kunai goes uh, drops down on his chest onto the edge and push himself to a flip from there, dodging uh, a few other kunais. And um, there probably will be some cloth errors because uh, Cinema 4D cloth en engine isn't that good and it usually needs a lot of um, fine touching, <laughs> fine detailing whatever you want to call it um, but yeah um, I'm, I'm showing this too because I'm sure this can be helpful for someone and uh, if you're interested in this kind of stuff leave a comment please and uh, um, I, I might do tutorials for this kind of rigging that I have done here this kind of rigging uh, goes well with anything, it goes well with cartoon characters, uh, simple characters like fishes or uh, com more complex characters like uh, quadruples, like horses, dogs and uh, octopus and everything like that. Uh, I could do a tutorial series um, first rigging the character with the bone tool and uh, showing why and where you should put bones. Um, for example, if you look at the character's knee here, you can see the knee bone is at the very edge of the front of the knee. That's because when it uh, rotates from there, it cuts the knee to the back side and the clipping will occur there, like it would happen on a real human. Um, 
then of course you have to work with the weight tool and uh, add some ICO chains and poles but those are very simple. Cinema 4D I have used Maya 3ds Max and uh, for animating and I think Cinema 4D is the easiest uh, at least fastest to animate when you are animating a character that is uh, simple in a way that there isn't cloth dynamics and such and this is pretty much just a test project for me I'm trying out the uh, Cinema 4D stuff I have uh, hi hair and everything here you can already see on the Susano video that I have uploaded and uh, there's a that's uh, that's that video has went through After Effects too, and uh, actually go ahead and check it, and then come back to this video, and uh, because that's more previous, but that will be on the complete animation that I'm hoping to do here. Uh, this is scene two, what I'm working on here. I have seen one ready, but I haven't uploaded it anywhere. Um, yeah here that's pretty much it for I'm not going to ramble anymore so leave a comment about if, if you have tips for me or if you want tips or if you want to see more of this and uh, leave a like dislike and subscribe especially if you are uh, commenting for more of this or tutorials so you will be notified have a nice day.